another big leap in our quest to understand space and time. Just months after we had this big story, remember that? When we saw the first ever image of a black hole? Astronomers now tell us, they say, they have detected a black hole swallowing another behemoth, a neutron star. This is all thanks to a series of cosmic ripples picked up by detectors in Europe and the United States. And you know that any time we need to parse the fabric of the universe, we turn to our science reporter, Nicole Mortellaro, who is here to explain this discovery for us. Good morning. Good morning. Tell me more. So, I don't know if you remember back when in 2015, actually it was announced in 2016, we had this big gravitational wave that was detected, which proved Einstein there, yet another of Einstein's theories. <laughs> he was pretty smart that yeah, guy. Yeah, he was. And that was the merger of two black holes. Holes. And then we had another uh, merger of a black hole, uh, sorry, of a neutrons, of two neutron stars. And these neutron stars are really fascinating because just like black holes, there are these massive objects. And we when we talk massive, they can be big, but we, in this case, we're talking it has mass, so weight. Um, and neutron stars are amazing because neutron stars are about the size of a small city, about 20 kilometers across. And they, but the density, they are 10,000, a spoonful of that would be 10,000 tons, okay? In a spoonful. In a spoonful. Of neutron star. Right. Okay. So now imagine these two things meeting, a black hole and a neutron star. But that's exactly what they believe they've seen. They haven't confirmed it 100%. It's 99%. But they uh, believe that this gravitational wave that they've, uh, they've picked up through their detectors were actually a neutron star being gobbled up by a black hole. <laughs> I'm kind of thinking like Godzilla meets so and so. Yeah, who won yeah, that? I, who won that clash? Definitely Godzilla would be the uh, black hole. Uh huh. And what then if they think they've detected this collision? Black hole meets neutron star. Why do, why do we care about that? What's the significance That's of that? That's always a, a big question, right? So these detectors, this time in, in the original one with the two black holes merging, they were from LIGO and there are two detectors in, um, in the US. This one was the additional detector, Virgo, and that was the one that's in Italy. So these two things are collaborating and pinpointing these massive events, okay? Mm -hmm. um, faint signals, but massive events. And this is what's this is telling us more about the universe and our creation. Uh, we are curious about how we got here, how the universe works, and getting information about these. And the more we have, the better it is, the more we know. Okay. Dot, uh, cbcnews.ca if you want to read more about that because there's a lot of detail attached to this fascinating discovery. And thanks, Nicole, as always, for coming in to tell us more.